Hi guys, in this video, I am going to discuss about program to display triangle using a star in this format. Next, I am going to discuss about the try and method of this program. So, if you debug the code, control comes to main function. Here, after that, go inside. So, right here, I have taken to int user variable i and next j. So, right here, i start from 1. That check the condition 1 less than equal to 5. Condition is true. So, right here, j start from 1 and uh, that check the condition uh, j less than equal to i. So, i and j value 1 so 1 equal to 1 condition is true so that go inside print a star now here after j gonna increase by 1 so j become 2 now or uh, that check the condition 2 less than equal to uh, 1 the condition is not true so here after control comes to this point and cursor brings the new line so here after i gonna increase by 1 so i become 2 now or uh, check the condition 2 less than equal to 5 so the condition is true. So j start from 1 again and j less than equal to i. So 1 less than equal to 2. Condition is true. So here after uh, that print is star. So j gonna increase by 1. So j is not 2. Check the condition 2 less than equal to 2. So condition is true. So add here print star. Now j gonna increase by one. So j is now three. Check the condition three less than equal to two. Condition is not true. So cursor bring to the new line. Here after i gonna increase by one. So i become three now. Check the condition three less than equal to five. Condition is true. So j start from one. Check the condition one less than equal to or uh, three. Condition is true, that go inside print star. So here after j gonna increase by 1, so j is now 2. Check the condition 2 less than equal to 3. Condition is true, print star. So here after j gonna increase by 1, so j is now 3. Check the condition 3 less than equal to 3. Condition is true, print star. Now here after j gonna increase by 1, so j is now 4. Check the condition. 4 less than equal to uh, 3, condition is not true, so cursor going to the near line. Now here after j gonna increase by 1, so right here, uh, sorry, i gonna increase by 1, so i become 4 now, check the condition, 4 less than equal to 5, condition is true, so just start from 1 again, and check the condition, 1 less than equal to uh, 4, condition is true, print star. So here after j gonna increase by 1, so j is not 2, check the condition 2 less than equal to 4, condition is true, print a star. So j gonna increase by 1, so j is now 3, check the condition 3 less than equal to 4, condition is true, print a star. So here after uh, j gonna increase by 1, so j is now 4, check the condition 4 less than equal to 4, condition is true, print a star. So here after j increase by 1, so j is now 5, check the condition 5 less than equal to 4, condition is true, not true, so cursor going to the new line. Here after that increase the value of i, i is now 5, check the condition 5 less than equal to 5, so 5 equal to 5, condition is true, so j start from 1 again, check the condition 1 less than equal to 5, condition is true, print is true. So I to uh, j is now 2. So check the condition 2 less than equal to 5, condition is true, print is star. So here after j gonna increase by 1, so j is now 3, 3 less than equal to 5, condition is true, print is star. 
So here after check the nine case by one. So J is now four. Check the condition four less than equal to five. Condition is true. Print is true. So J is now five. Check the condition five less than equal to five. Condition is true. Print is true. So J becomes six now. Check the condition six less than equal to five. Condition is not true. Cursor comes to this point. Now cursor brings to the new line. Here after I go nine case by one. So I becomes six now. So I have to check the condition six less than equal to five. Condition is not true. So that out from upper for loop. Uh, so control here after control out for main function. So final output we have this all. So this is the trial method of this program. So I hope guys you understand. So thanks for watching. See you in next video.